there are upwards of 375,000 Canadians who go south to the States for the winter, but those plans may have hit a snag because of the border shutdown. Yeah, two local companies have teamed up to get snowbirds into the U.S. with their vehicles so they can enjoy life as usual in their winter homes. Adam Atkinson has the details. A company called Great Lakes Helicopter out of Cambridge is using the Hamilton Airport to shuttle snowbirds to Buffalo while their vehicles are trucked across the border by GRM Transportation, all for a total cost of $1,900. We'll fly in your own private helicopter, bring your pets, whatever you got, uh, over to Buffalo International where you'll clear customs there and then your car will be waiting just outside the executive terminal where we land. Cheryl Fleming and her husband Adrian have been going down to Homosassa Springs, Florida for the last 10 years. They own a house down there and skipping this winter wasn't even a thought despite the pandemic. I know the cases are bad here, but we're more rural. You know, like, I think I would be worried if I was more in a bigger town like, you know, Tampa or Miami or something like that. As for the trip, Fleming says it was a breeze. It was 25 minute drive over in the helicopter. And as we we're coming down into the Buffalo airport, like where the private planes and, and helicopters are, we could see our vehicle already sitting there. And it was, it was a great experience. Fleming says while her friends and family understand their decision to still go south for the winter, she says other people aren't as accepting. But according to U.S. border officials, Canadian snowbirds aren't doing anything wrong. Well, the border restrictions that have been in place um, have always been specific to the land border and not necessarily specific to air travel. Jeremy Rood says he's made eight trips in the last two weeks and there's more than 30 other flights booked. It's no different than, you know, if you want to hop on Air Canada or WestJet and fly into Fort Lauderdale or Fort Myers or Orlando or you want to go, those, those flights are going. They're a commercial carrier and us at Great Lakes, we're a commercial carrier as well. Rood says the majority of his customers are flying with their pets. Adam Atkinson, CHH News, Hamilton.